Greetings YouTube, this is Venomous Woe here. Now before we begin, I'd like to say that this battle is a little different than from what you've seen so far. The footage was taken from an online tool called the Pokemon Online Replay Viewer. The link for it will be in the description box. Now what it does is that it takes a text log of Pokemon Online and convert it into an animation. There will be animated sprites and, anim and attack animations. It's pretty darn cool. Now, there are several reasons why I'm doing this. One, it just plain looks cool. I mean, I think you guys will enjoy it a bit more than just static footage of me playing Pokemon Online. Another thing is that I don't have to depend on the video on the video file existing so much in order to actually get stuff done. All I just need is the text log. So I think it'll be easier for me to keep track of because there are several things that can go wrong with a video file. Like it can get encoded wrong or it can get um, lost. With the text log, I don't think I have to worry about that as much. So yeah, just sit back and enjoy the battle. Alright, now that we've gotten that out of the way, let's focus on the battle. This is against Amber99. She's got a Hydreigon out. I've got the Fury, which is my Volcarona. I go straight for the Quiver Dance, boost my special attack, special defense, and speed, and I take that Earth Power like a boss. I go straight for the Bug Buzz. That takes him out for um, super effective damage. Awesome. So now Vaporeon is on the field. I'm going to go for Bug Buzz again does all oh well over half its attack Scald does quite a bit to me unfortunately despite the special defense Left Vaporeon gets some leftovers recovery I go for the bug buzz and Vaporeon is out of there now she sends in her scissor and she goes straight for the bullet punch that takes out the fury and it's like aww but unfortunately for her, <coughs> Flame Body activates and Scissor gets burned, so yay! I send out the Joy, which is my Verizion. She switches into Chandelure just as I get my Calm Mind boost. So unfortunately, I have to end up switching out of there. I go into the Fear, which is my Dusclops. He, she goes for Fire Blast. She switches out Chandelure into Umbreon, and the Fear is sitting here with like less than half its health. Sucker Punch fails. So she goes for Heal Bell, Scissor gets cured of its burn, and I go for the Taunt. Umbreon uses Payback, it's super effective. I go for Pain Split for some recovery. So she switches out into Skarmory. I go for the Will-O-Wisp, Skarmory is burned, so it can't really do much offensively in any case, although Skarmory is not really an offensive Pokemon anyway. I go for the Taunt, she tries to phase me out, but unfortunately since she's taunted, it doesn't quite work out. I switch into the Joy, she goes for Brave Bird, it does quite a bit despite being burned, but that's thanks to Verizon's typing more than anything else. So I go for Focus Blast, that takes out Skarmory, get that Leftovers Recovery there, I switch into Chandelure, go for the Shadow, no, she switches into Chandelure, goes for the Shadow Ball, and takes out Verizion. Now I switch into the Sorrow, which is my Gliscor, I think it's the same Gliscor as uh, Molester was, basically a Jolly Gliscor with max speed and max attack. I go for the Earthquake, go get that Toxic Orb up for Poison Heal, go for Earthquake again, Scizor's almost out of there. Scizor goes for Swords Dance, plus two attack. Scizor goes for Bullet Punch, does quite a bit thanks to Swords Dance, but I go for the Earthquake and Scizor's down. Now Chandelure is on the field again, she goes for Shadow Ball, takes out 
the remainder of the Sorrow's Health. I switch out into the Pain. I don't know why the Tentacruel sprite, sprite isn't animated. I guess it's probably a glitch with the software. Anyway, she switches out into Umbreon. I go for Hydro Pump. Does not do that much. I switch out into the End, which is my Durant. Umbreon goes for Wish. She calls Umbreon back. Chandelure comes back on the field. I go for Hone Claws. And this is where I do something incredibly stupid. I decide to stay in on Chandelure. It's like, what can Chandelure... What can Durant do against Chandelure? I mean... Seriously. Fire Blast takes out the end. And I send out the fear. Yeah, all these Pokemon have Metal Gear Solid 3 names. It, they're named after the Cobra unit in Metal Gear Solid 3, so that's why they have such weird nicknames. Or they're all or that they all follow a theme. So I taunt Umbreon and force it to attack. Umbreon goes for payback, I go for sucker punch. So basically, I just stay in for some odd reason, I don't know why. So it's basically just an exchange of blows between Umbreon and Dusclops. Umbreon takes out my um, Dusclops? Oh, not quite. The Umbreon's taunt is over. I go for Sucker Punch again. Umbreon goes for Payback, takes me out. In comes the Pain. So now the Pain goes for Giga Drain. I don't know why I went for Giga Drain instead of Hydro Pump, but whatever. Umbreon uses Wish. I go for Giga Drain again. That takes it out. So Chandelure is back on the field. Chandelure takes damage from the Shadow Ball. I mean, Tentacruel takes damage from the Shadow Ball. And I finish it off with Hydro Pump, and that is the end of the game. So good job, Amber99. You played pretty well. See you all next time, guys.